welcome to viewers on Channel 7 in Australia. Second session of this, the third day. The Wanderers is underway, and Australia have had a very good day so far. Jennifer Blewett needs one for 50. And it's there. Down to the boundary for four. He goes to 53. And Australia four for 298. Yes, just five minutes shy of three hours for Greg Lewis, 50. Acknowledges his teammates and that of Dave Richardson, who walked past and said, well played. One of Greg Blewett's support. Well, Greg Blewett have done very well. Eight boundaries, 25 scoring shots. In. Bill Adams. A cult figure at just 20. A bit like you, David. <laughs> Tell you what, this kid has got some skill. And uh, let's hope that... <laughs> Very fast. Brings up the 300 for Australia. In fact, the scores are tied at the moment. Four for 302. Blew it too aware for that one. Let's just have a look at his wagon wheel there. In there for 197 minutes. Handers comes over the wicket to the left handers. I think from time to time that one's just tucked away, sliding down the leg side. Four runs off the inside edge, but I think from time to time. Blew it down the wicket and down the grounds. He played a couple of very positive shots like that this morning. I think he's decided that he's got, not going to hang around the crease and wait for the spinners to get him. So he'll be proactive. He takes the score to four for 315. Highest run scorer for Australia. Oh, okay. Shot from Blewett. Just oh. Spin beats. The uh, backward point fielder there and goes all the way to the boundary. Disappointing for the bowler. Really steamed in and they chanted every ball. Clap, clap, clap. The Australian saw it off. Well, Blewett charged him and said, cop that. And that is a magnificent shot. You can talk about the fact that it's probably time for the Australians to put the foot on the accelerator to some extent. Well, an interesting statistic that we'll show you throughout the series here between South Africa and Australia. So Alan Donald, uh, along with most of the bowlers, pretty good, making the batsman play. Lovely shot. Blewett is a lovely straight driver against fast bowling. He has a beautiful front step, as we've mentioned before, and that is perfect. And through him, and a half a shout from third or fourth or fifth slip. And I think Donald's got his arms on his head because he doesn't know how they didn't bowl. Blewett in the 80s, and Hansi Cronier and Alan Donald will be hoping for a similar reward here. Crack that, cop that, go and get that. And that is Steve Waugh at his very best. Brings up the 350, in fact, 350. That he can go on and get his third. That popped over the gully. It's gone for four. Strange looking stroke. But he's into the 90s. And on 87 as well. Amazing. I think... Donald. And that's through for four more. Again, width. And Steve Waugh's bread and butter shot. He's just gone to 91 and now the race. So who's going to get the 100? Pulled by Blewett, wide of mid on, four more. And he goes to 97. Yeah, good shot here. The talk around the town was when Adam... Does it beat Adams? It does, and that's his hundred. A magnificent century to Greg Blewett, his third in Test cricket. Well played, Bluey, on a big stage at 
the Wanderers.